Well, here is one of the Saab V4s from uh, the Finnish Saab team. And uh, on the door here it says Simo Lampinen. And who's this? Who are you? Yes, I'm Simo Lampinen, yes, correct. Yeah. What kind of a car are we looking at here? We are looking at... Oh, mm, oh gonna, uh, yeah, it's on, okay, yeah. We are looking at the most famous of the blue and white cars from 1975 and, and um, the 502 on of which I won Finnish championship then last time and I was second after Hannu Mikkola in the Thousand Lakes when one of the carburetors, the the inlet, the, these uh, air filters the big air filters had, had, yeah. had one in the front so that the, the um, welding broke on the on one of the plates and it choked for for three stages and I lost before that I was winning I lost a, a minute and a half and then we were half a minute after Hanno. Okay. But this is, and but this is incredible car. Yeah. The, this is the car and the Tommy Tikamaki here has saved this oh, this I part don't... in of, of Finnish rally history as as Helsinki in Sanomat in Finland made a big story about it how many years ago? Ten, ten years ago, ago when it was the car was ready. Okay, can you say anything about the engine if you come with me here? Yes, uh, I'm not so good on engines. You're not so good at engines, but you were good at driving them. Yeah, well, yeah. it wasn't that enough. Yeah. So the engines here with uh, with a big carburetor system, yes. um, was this something that was built in Trollhättan or was it built in Finland? 100% built everything in Finland. Okay. Every, there's not one part from Trojetan on this car, nothing. So, what would so, you, yeah. so I tell you one more thing that yes. Stieg was after us in Arctic Rally yeah. and in, in Hanki Rally in Finland after Tapio Rainio and me, when we won, he was second, second, second. And he was a little bit of blur like this, ah, oh, what is so much better on these cars and things. So then we invited him to to Finland and gave him this one five oh uh, no, five, five, yeah. one five oh one yes we gave the five oh one and then he won first time and we were after him on on the hunky rally yeah. okay. and this is also in my presentation this afternoon yep. the whole story on that one well that's good and pictures from the rally department Finland by Scan Auto mm. it was incredible in the same premises of where the, uh, the car sales are in Helsinki, where the where their um, uh, what should I say um, uh, offices are, because you could not build in that area it was so tight anything new. So they gave three four hundred square meters of that for the competition department. Well, do you Seven cars are built. Yeah. Do you think we can start it up and uh, listen to the, yes. the Finnish sure, tunes? Sure, no problem. At all. Do we have any electricity on here? Yeah, I yeah, think so. yeah, yeah. He drove the car from home here. Okay. So, so. we will listen to an historic uh, car with a, an historic driver and uh, hopefully also a historic sound. Yes. That was nasty. No. Do you drive it or you, it's a toe you stroker? Say, you say, you say the, <laughs> is, it a, is it a toe stroker? No, 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 it's so, so thirsty. <laughs> it's very thirsty. Uh, yes. My white socks are now grey. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, it was great seeing you uh, with your old car again. And yep. uh, this is not the first time you're around here in Trollhattan, and we will probably see you for many, many years to come. I have been here first time 62. And when I start 61, 62, so I've been since then, and there was always a funny thing with all the all the plates. So I drove a Trollhättan car, won my first 2000, like 63 and 64. Yeah. That was a Trollhättan built car, and and uh, then it was the question that the car had to come to Finland. How was it possible? Because the re regulation law was different. So I drove up to Stockholm, took my very good friend Pico Truberg there with me. We were over on the boat. He drove it out 
as a Swede in Helsinki and then I put the special place, normal place on the car and then I took him to, to Helsinki airport and he was already back in Stockholm in his office 11 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> yeah. This we did several times. Yeah. And we met for the first time when I was born here in Trollhättan in 1965, I remember. Okay. Well okay. maybe you remember it more than I did. <laughs> Okay, that was Fine. nice. Thank uh, you very much. Some great uh, sights from the Saab Festival 2013 in Trollhättan, Sweden. This is Saturday. Uh, tomorrow is going to be the big day with the uh, all, all the. the well, it's going to be a big crowd of older cars here tomorrow. So welcome to Trollhättan and join us in the great sunshine and with some really lovely, beautiful people and a great crowd, as you can see here when I turn this around a little bit here. Yeah.